Hi guys, this is the week ahead reading, Monday the 8th of May. As usual, I'm going to do three cards. So the first one is what to let go of. Second one, what to focus on. And the third one is the energy that the week is bringing in, okay? Now it does tie in with the reading I did for Sunday the 7th. So make sure to check that out too because... And in that reading, we were going from a place of being stuck, being at a standstill to a place of fast movement forward within the next week. And this does tie in with it. OK, so what to let go of is the Eight of Cups. And the Eight of Cups is a card of feeling like there's something missing in your life and making the move forward um, to go after whatever it is you're missing. OK, to change your life now. Because this is in a position of what to let go of, this guy is walking off alone. So maybe it's that you need to let go of the feeling or the thoughts that you need to do something alone. Um, this is a it's the cups. It's a card of love, emotions, intuition, relationships. So maybe, maybe you're feeling that this is a a lone journey that you need to go on. But like I said, because it's a card of what you need to let go of this week then I would see it as letting go of the feeling that you have to do it alone maybe just be aware that there are are people around you who want to help you could help you would love to help you do you know um also we have a full moon so um know that your intuition your intuition is always going to guide you anyway so just listen to it you know but that's letting go of. So let go of the feeling that you need to do things alone. Um, what you need to focus on is the Queen of Swords. How perfect. So the Queen of Swords is a woman who is in control of her mind. Swords is the element of air. It's the mind. It's thoughts. It's communication. Her head, as you see, is well above the clouds. So her mind is clear now. She's completely focused on what it is she wants to do. Um, and she's not going to leave anyone stop her. The Queen of Swords is a woman who will talk the absolute truth. She's not afraid to maybe upset anyone. She'll tell you. She'll say it as it is. Okay. So what you need to focus on this week is saying it as it is. So let go of the feeling of needing to move forward alone. Get your mind clear. Say everything as it is. And the energy that the week will bring in is the Knight of Wands, which ties in perfectly with the Eight of Wands from the Sunday the 7th reading. Fast movement forward. So this is the energy the week is bringing in. So be prepared, have your armour on and be prepared to race forward on your horse um, with whatever it is you want in life to do this coming week. Okay. So that's the message for this coming week. Hope it made sense. Please do leave likes and comments. And if this message could help anyone you know, please do share it with them. And I will talk to you soon. Thanks a million, guys. Bye.